Here we go, how fast day one, I'm joined with Shrapnel. How are you guys doing? Not too bad. Good. Not bad, yeah. not bad. Yeah. Knackered. <laughs> <laughs> I was just going to say a good trip up, but judging on that one. Nah, no, not bad at all. Right. Not bad at all. Long, we, what, we left at eight. Yeah, eight, it was a long one, but it was all right. It was just, it's, it's a wonky, wonky road, isn't it? <laughs> 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 <Just a> wonky <laughs> road. <laughs> now, we have the honour of seeing you guys at Beer Mageddon last year. Storm is set. Um, Cheers, man. My, it did make my, eyes, my ears and eyes bleed. Get so it's behind the lens at the time as well. So. <laughs> absolutely cracking, but obviously since then, your album's come out as well, uh, Virus Conspiracies. How's that gone down? Amazingly well. Yes, yeah, the reviews good. have been really surprising, I think. Yes. Not expected the reaction that we've got so far. So, yeah. um, being sort of unknown, yeah. you, you don't know what to expect. So, um, the fact, I mean, you see some horror stories online as well <laughs> these days, so people are really critical. So, no, the fact that everyone's been really positive is amazing. That's been great. Yeah. It's also a good label to be under as well. Yeah, brilliant. Well, yeah. Our favourite bands have been. Well, I was going to say, I mean, I can remember the, the, the first time I bought an Emperor shirt back when I was almost about 15 or something. Yeah. And I can remember the day, what I'd done that night and everything. So the whole time I've been buying music has always been candlelight. Yeah. You know, like the, all these awesome bands and stuff. So the, sort of that moment when you find out, when he gives me a phone call, I'm like, <laughs> yeah, it's good. We wish we could stick around to, to Sunday because um, Corrosion play and yeah. obviously they're, they're on the same thing. But massively, one of my favourite bands. Fucking love so. that band. Yeah, really yeah, it's been it's, it's awesome. Absolutely brilliant. So it's probably a, a dream tour uh, later on. You guys, <laughs> have, a, have you ever been to the Yeah, yeah just a bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah be nice. Well. Yeah, get going. Definitely a nice way to start. <laughs> That's a good idea. I thought we'd write that one down. Yeah. yeah, no. yeah. <laughs> so you're, obviously, you're a relatively young band as well, I've been in the industry. Is it two, about 2009? Yes, started, yeah. there, you sort of, sort of started. So if you think about how you've progressed in a very short space of time, hats off to you, well done. But did you ever think back in 2009, this is where we're going to be? Um, <laughs> Not initially, no. No, 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 <laughs> no we started with laugh, fun. wasn't it? It was just fun, wasn't it? Yeah. It was just a giggle. So, I think it, we sort of progressively got a bit more serious the more shows we got and the more we could think, oh. If that's know, possible, what, what, yeah, what, exactly. what, what else could we do, sort of thing? You know? What's the next step? So, you know, we saw the, the, I remember the first rehearsal we ever had, you know, it was just sort of me and Chris from, from these guys. And uh, I think the first one, a drummer no drummer. didn't turn up. <laughs> shit, just shit, <laughs> shit, <laughs> shit, it just sucked. <laughs> and then um, I think it was kind of when we got Jay and um, line up shuffles and whatnot, we got um, a new drummer in and Jay, and that was like. Okay, this is yeah, maybe not something. shit anymore. This is kind of cool. So, <laughs> <laughs> but, well, we, we kind of got a show with um, Sepultura in, in Norwich, where we're, where we're from. Yeah. That was like, that kind of sort of kicked that off was from quite, there. That was quite like, unbelievable. Well, right yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, I mean. So, we'd been together, what, six months? Yeah. I say, I Seven months? That was, always a, that was always a bloody milestone for me, you know, play where I've always gone to see my, my favourite bands and stuff, and then to actually get to that place alone, you know, that was incredible. Yeah. Absolutely the, incredible. The thing we sort of do is like, okay, it's not going to get better than this, so enjoy it. Yeah, yeah. After like, this really weekend, enjoy it, so you know. Enjoy the moment, yeah. it just keeps progressing. Yeah. yeah. So did um, Sepultura, did the guys give you any sort of advice, or did they listen to your set? Yeah, they did. Yeah, they did, which was crazy. Um, seeing because Andreas Kisser was to the left of the stage and that was I, mean, I didn't see him for most of the set and then looking up and he was just like in the corner of my eye, like, oh god <laughs> <laughs> oh, we didn't speak to like, we didn't really speak to him that much Derek Derek, Derek for yeah, yeah. Yeah. it was cool but no no not really but. We just kind of stood in the corner, sort of really yeah. starstruck. Yeah. Well, <laughs> we just still do it now. I mean, we're terrible. You know, we don't, we don't own what's given to us at all. We're like, whoa, you know. <laughs> but I think it's the best way to be. It's always better to be humble, I think, because we still, what well, we still go to gigs, we still go to festivals. You know, we're just normal people. Isn't it? well, that's the thing. Even though you you've got your album out, out there, you're still going out and you're supporting. Yeah, definitely. As well. So so what's set for the rest of the year for you guys? Anything well, you can talk about or is yeah, there uh, there's some things we can't 
Yeah. But yeah, no, because we've just started with a new booking agency with Factory Music, um, so we're looking to get a lot more busy with the touring now. Yeah. Um, we've got a bit of a break after this, haven't we, with April and most of May, and then and then we're looking to sort of just play as much as possible. Yeah. So get over to Europe, I think, is the next biggest goal. So. I think we we kind of got picked up at a time where the sort of festivals like this are kind of booked up in advance, so we kind of missed out. This year, yeah. on a lot of festival stuff, yeah, really, really. yeah, we sort of, um, so we're kind of just like scrapping for what we can for this year, and then so, uh, next, for next year, year it's going to be sort of next year is going to be the one, so mega busy. Yeah, that's it as well. So obviously, you've set your list out, but then it's given the organisers a little bit longer yeah, to, to do it properly. Yeah. You yeah. And the word no, of mouth is spreading. Yeah. Yeah. You really need to check these guys. These guys need to be on the bill. The good thing as well, yeah, we've got the head start on next year, yeah. big time. So. And we've got the album, we've got all the press back, so next year is going to be, it should be really busy for us. So I awesome. think this year is purely just proving the point, yeah. and just keeping the hype going, and just, just doing it really. Yeah. 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 This year, have a fest, next year, whacking. If you can make that happen, yeah, go for it. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's cool. <laughs> I, can't, I won't be able to afford to go into any festivals next year, so if we can get on like yeah. five of them, that'd be good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just go see some things. Yeah, we'll forget Bucking, Hellfest, Bloodstock, Hammerfest. Yeah, Hellfest is sort of there. Just We're desperate to play there. Just help us to be playing. Well, I was kind of hoping, you know, because Emperor doing like, this big comeback this year, you know, it's like. Or a candlelight, you know. <laughs> like I sort of keep hinting the question, they sort of just Shut ignore up. me, you know, like go away. <laughs> no. How about Americas? Would you like to... oh, We'd yeah. love to. Yeah, love hell to. yeah. yeah. That'd be fucking just, brilliant. Yeah. Early days, but yeah, hopefully it happens. Well, we, we were quite lucky because originally the album wasn't supposed to, the first album wasn't supposed to be released over there. You know, and that was the second one that was we get to do a second yeah. one yeah. it's going to go from there but luckily we, we got to put it out over there as well so yeah. I guess if there's the interest there as well it would be mm. going us going over there for no reason or whatever but yeah we, we keep getting people asking us and stuff so if, if we could find a way then interesting say we've had crazy interest from like broad countries yeah yeah, yeah. It's, been yeah. Cool. Oh, it's building well it's building there's it, lots yeah. it's coming in all the time now so Hopefully, the, well, the more interest we get, the further we can go, really. Yeah. So. Because so the UK, UK crash bands are starting to reconquer what they did back in the early 80s as well. The likes of like, Virus and Violator, the guys with the, the footprint of the crash and they dominate the worldwide scene. And once again, with you guys, obviously, guys like yourselves, the reinsurgence is coming back up and the UK is getting up for yeah, the knowledge like this hippie. Crap. <laughs> <laughs> kind of, to me, it kind of feels like we missed a lot of the resurgent stuff with Eva and um, yeah. Gamma Bomb and everything. But yeah, it's been it's been cool. Hopefully, we get to play a lot more. So. I was going to say the thing is because I'm the new guy joined in yeah. from afar. Shrapnel has always someone watched, but they with the reviews, they've not we've not been classed. Alongside the bands no. that were in that, which Not has so been much. interesting for me, it's been nice to hear that. That's just the shrapnel of their own beast. Yeah, well, I think that's what's been really nice with the reviews that the guys have got. I think it's, I think I think it's got to help where we, we are as well. Sound like thrash, though, in like, I mean, we are a thrash band, but there's so many different elements of music in our band that we like, we're not really, I wouldn't strict, strictly call us thrash, but we do have. Like such a broad spectrum of music in the fuck fucking mu 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 music, you know. Yeah. Really like I'd say what more death it's metal it's stuff. Yeah, right? there's, there's a lot of stuff in there. That's cool. Well, guys, I wish you all the best. Cheers, man. Thank you. Have the best. So hopefully, <coughs> can, I, can I assume try and catch you somewhere in the UK throughout the rest of the year? I think, I think um, September we've got another. We're looking at another UK tour. Which is an yeah. It's being confirmed pretty yeah. soon, but yeah, there'll be other stuff. Sure. We'll be about. We'll <laughs> do as much as we can. Keep busy. We'll just, <laughs> we'll just turn up and play the pub for you. We'll just do that. Thanks, Tom. Awesome. Awesome. Keep up the good work. Man. Cheers, man. Cool. Thanks a lot. Thanks, mate. Awesome. Thank you awesome. very much. Cool. Cheers, dude. Cheers, dude. Where's the bar? To the bar. Where's the bar? Cheers, thank you.